What's up, YouTube? My name is Clickwood, and I am back again today bringing you guys another Madden 25 Ultimate Team video. And today, guys, we are actually going to be doing a review on a card that I recently got a chance to play with. And it was because the subscriber was so nice, and he actually allowed me to play with this card for like almost an entire week to get good gameplay footage with it and just to give you guys my opinion on what I think about this card. Now the card that we're actually going to be reviewing as you can see on your screen is actually Golden Ticket Ed Reed. This is a free safety 99 overall card. It's in the legendary tier and it actually adds plus two to strength which I believe is one of the most underrated attributes in all of Madden 25 Ultimate Team. It is actually the attribute that will allow you to not get pancake blocked if you're a safety. So that is something that I think is extremely important as I play a lot of people who, like me, like to run the football a lot. This card will help your entire defense. I'm not going to tell you that it's going to be the end-all, cure-all to stopping the run by any means because this card itself actually is not that great against the run because it doesn't have high hit power and things like that. But it does an absolutely beastly job in coverage, as you're going to see on some of these plays here, as it knocks away passes, it gets interceptions. Uh, it has actually the highest catching attribute of any safety card in this game, with the exception of Des Bryant free safety and the two Calvin Johnson free safety cards. So in my opinion, this is the type of card that you can definitely use as a complement to another safety card, like if you have that Calvin Johnson free safety card, uh, that can absolutely be a playmaker for your defense, and it's a card that you do not need to user control. Now you're actually going to see me here in a, quite a few of these highlights where I actually user control like this interception here. Uh, I get some good user picks with it, but in my opinion, it's actually better used as a computer defender. And, that, and that's not to say, of course, that you can't use it as a manual defender like yourself controlling it. But the thing is, is that it has such good play recognition, awareness, man coverage, zone coverage, everything like that. It knocks away passes by itself. You do not need to use or control it. So that's one of the things that I find this card to be a big advantage for. Um, I really do like this card overall. Now, the one thing that I will say is that although you guys are seeing some pretty cool interceptions here, and dang it, he stepped out of bounds on that play. Oh, that frustrated me when it happened, but whatever. It was The game was over, as you can see by the score. But, um, you know, the one thing that I don't really like about this card, if I had to pick one thing, is that it just doesn't really have high enough hit power. Now that's not to say that it won't get tackles or anything like that because it does a decent enough job, but forcing fumbles with it, it just didn't really seem to happen for me. Now it does knock away passes and and it'll, you know, force incompletions and things like that like you're seeing in some of these uh highlights, but Overall, the hit power just wasn't really there for me, and that was a little bit of a disappointment. Now, I know Ed Reed is not known for his big hits, so I'm not really that surprised. But when you compare it to some of the other Ultimate Legend cards, uh, it just doesn't quite stack up in that category. So, overall, I think that this is one of the best free safety cards that you're going to find in Madden 25 Ultimate Team. And one of the things that I like to do is compare to the other cards. Now, this this card here is actually an upgraded version of the previous card that came out months and months ago which was the Madden 25 Ed Reed card and that card when it came out was probably the best free safety in the game when it first came out now since all these ultimate legends and some of the golden ticket cards and things like that have come out now you're actually seeing that card going for 60 70 80 thousand coins depending on the day and the system that you're on so you can actually see here with some of the improvements that were made uh, from the the Madden 25 edition to the Ultimate Legend edition, there's a reason that this Ultimate Legend card is going for well over 300,000 coins on all consoles. One of the things, though, that I was a little bit disappointed in when I saw it about this card was that it does not actually increase the speed of the card. Now, what I mean by that is that the upgraded version, the golden ticket from the Madden 25 edition, I think this might be the only card, and somebody else, I'm sure will collect, correct me in the comments below if that's not correct, but I'm pretty sure this is the only card that was upgraded that the person that, that uh, did the upgrade on the card did not improve the player's speed. Now, 94 speed is not bad for a safety by any means. This is still an excellent card. I'm not trying to complain, but 
a little bit of a boost in speed. Bring it up to 96 to 98. It would be great. You know, this card would be even that much better. Uh, I, I don't know if that was an option, but some of the things that they did improve on this card were things like catching. It actually increased the catching by 9, the jumping by 13, which I thought was really impressive because it's actually now one of the best in terms of jumping. It actually has 99 jumps, so it swats away just about everything, and uh, that's one of the things that I really enjoyed with it when I was playing with it. It does still actually increase the hit power on the card to 96, and now, like I was saying before, the 96 hit power on its by itself sounds amazing. The problem is that the other free safety cards that are out now have higher hit powers than that. So it's kind of just a little bit low in that category. It's still not bad, like I said. But things like play recognition were increased a little bit. And then it also increased this card's zone coverage. From the Madden 25 edition to the Golden Ticket edition, it's four better in zone coverage. It actually has 101 zone coverage, which is very, very nice. Uh, that's probably one of the best that you're going to find in this game. Uh, it, it does an amazing job in coverage. Like I said, without you even user controlling it, this card will play better than most safeties that you're going to find. Uh, I can't really think of many that are going to do better, if any, in coverage. So that's the thing that I liked most about this card is that I didn't need to user control it in order to make it an elite playmaker for my team. I was able to user control my other free safety card, which in a lot of these videos was the free safety Calvin Johnson card. And that really is a big advantage because I like to user control that card for the exact opposite reason that I do not, you know, that I don't control the Ed Reed card. And that, and that is that that card, the Calvin Johnson card doesn't have very good uh, play recognition. It doesn't have good zone cover and things like that so it's not good to allow the computer to control that card however when you're controlling it it becomes an amazing player exact opposite with Ed Reed you actually probably in most cases are going to make this card worse if you try to use or control it so I think that in my opinion this Ed Reed card is the perfect complement to that Calvin Johnson card if you're going to, to, to use two safeties that are like the golden ticket level cards uh, go with these two they're absolutely beastly and again, I really do like this Ed Reed card. Is it worth 325,000 coins? <sighs> that's that's a tough one because I think that although it's definitely worth a lot of coins, there are other cards like the free safety Rod Woodson card that is maybe not quite as good. The, the ultimate legend I'm talking. Uh, maybe not quite as good as this Ed Reed card. However, it's about half the price. So, uh, you know, it, it, you kind of have to make your determination of, uh, you know, what's your level of budget that you have for this position. Because if you have 400,000 coins to spend, yeah, go ahead and get the Ed Reed. But if you're looking for an area where you can improve your team and you still maybe want to have some extra coins to spend at another position, maybe the Ed Reed card might not be your best option. You might want to look at something like that Rod Woodson. Uh, but again, you know, of course, if, if you're somebody that just is looking to compile the best possible team, Ed Reed is definitely up there. Uh, certainly, there are other free safety cards that you could make the case are better. But in my opinion, there, it doesn't get a whole lot better than this. I, I mean, he's going to make just about every play that you're going to possibly want a free safety to make. Yeah, there's, there's cards like the uh, Ultimate Legend Sean Taylor that is probably better than this one. Uh, I, actually, I don't think that it's really even a question. Ultimate Legend Sean Taylor, in my opinion, is the best free safety in this game. You could make a case, of course, for Calvin Johnson, and I, I would in some cases, but at the same time, though, uh, my opinion is that Sean Taylor is better when you consider the fact that you don't have to user control him. So, again, it's it's all a matter of personal preference, what player you like to user control, and things like that. So, overall, again, Ed Reed, absolutely beastly. Worth the coins if you have them to spend. If you're looking to spend a little bit less, though, a card like Ultimate Legend Rod Woodson is going to suit you just fine for about half the price, so I might go in that direction. With that being said, guys, I want to thank you for tuning in for this card review. Sorry it went a little long here. I started to kind of rant and ramble and things like that, but I hope I gave you guys some good information. It'll help you make a good decision with your Madden Ultimate team. Thank you guys again for tuning in, and I will talk to you beautiful bitches again soon.